Hi, my name is Glenn, and I'm a volunteer here at the Aerospace Museum of California Air Park. And today I'd like to show you a few of our aircraft as part of Armed Forces Day. First, we have here the CH-3 helicopter, and it was built by Sikorsky, and it was a rescue and recovery helicopter during the Vietnam War. And it gained the affectionate nickname of the Jolly Green Giant. Now the way it would normally work, this aircraft, this helicopter, would be sitting on alert at a base in South Vietnam. And then they would get a radio call. And that radio call was from a pilot. And basically the way that it would work is the pilot would say, hey, I just got shot down. I'm here in the jungle. Bad guys are all around me. Will somebody come get me, please? So the helicopter takes off it's hovering around the jungle trying to locate that pilot. Well, while it's looking for the pilot, those bad guys the pilot referred to, North Vietnamese and Viet Cong soldiers, they're out there in the jungle too, and they are not dummies. They see the Jolly Green Giant helicopter and they go, aha, there must be a downed pilot someplace. Let's see if we can find him first make him a prisoner before they can rescue him. So to help with that, they take their rifles and their machine guns and their pistols and they start firing at the helicopter to try to discourage the crew from doing their job of rescuing the pilot. So that's the reason this helicopter here had 50 caliber machine guns out the windows on both sides that they used to fire back at those bad guys who were trying to discourage them from doing their job. So while all of that shooting is going on, there is a pararescue man standing here in this open door. And he's sitting there looking, trying to locate that downed pilot. Once he locates the pilot, he uses that hydraulic hoist to go down lift up the pilot and bring him back up while they're still shooting at each other. So not your typical Monday through Friday nine to five job. So once they get the pilot back here on board, they have a medical crew who can take care of any injuries that he sustained. Now this Jolly Green Giant helicopter could also hover on water. So say the pilot went down in the South China Sea. The pararescue man could jump out, retrieve the pilot, and bring him in that way. If they could find a clearing big enough to land, they could also bring the pilot in through a rear door that opens up there. Now, normally when they would go out on one of these rescue and recovery missions, the Jolly Green Giant helicopter would be paired with one of these Douglas A-1E Sky Raider aircraft. Now the A-1E originally started out as a carrier-based Navy fighter-bomber in the mid-1950s. But then the Air Force took 50 out of storage at the beginning of the Vietnam War to use for close air support and for rescue and recovery missions in tandem with the Jolly Green Giant helicopters. And as you see depicted here, the A-1E was a little bit better equipped to take care of those bad guys we referred to so that that way the Jolly Green Giant helicopter crew could focus their time and attention on rescuing the downed pilot. 